Ezio Auditor. Brave of you to stand alone against me, but also quite foolish. Assassin. And as you can probably tell by now, I am playing Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Ah, uh, it's about time. Revelations, hopefully, as I cross my fingers here, Revelations should be not too far ahead in the future for coming out. Um, I have already beaten Brotherhood. Um, I'm a little too obsessed with the Assassin's Creed storyline and history and all that good stuff to kind of wait for um, blind playthrough runs and things of that nature. And I, I, I can pretty much guarantee I'm not going to be doing a blind playthrough of Revelations. I'm going to play through that myself first. Um, so let's, uh, without further ado, let's get started here. Kind of hoping these videos don't get a lot of kill reports on YouTube like a lot of other LPs of this game have, so... And I hope this doesn't take long, otherwise I'll have to... Nope, that didn't take long. Okay. Uh, oops, wrong way. It's been so long since I've played on a PS2. Nope, that's... There we go. PS2? There we go. And I hate when you hit start, it puts an extra space at the end of your name. I don't think anyone ever expects to wake up one morning and find themselves caught in the middle of a war between two secret organizations. I know I didn't. But here I am. On one side are the Templars, better known these days as Abstergo Industries. They're in the business of control. Politics, economics, technology. They won't stop until every single one of us serves them. Literally. Fighting against them are the Assassins, a group dedicated to safeguarding humanity's free will. I was born into the Brotherhood. A couple of weeks ago, the Templars found me. They took me prisoner, strapped me into a machine they built and put me to work. It's called an Animus. It's where I spent most of my time, exploring the memories of my ancestors, discovering entire lives locked deep inside my DNA. First, I revisited the life of Altair ibn La'ahad, an assassin from the Crusades. The Templars wanted the location of something known as a Piece of Eden, an ancient artifact capable of bending people to their will. Once the Templars had what they were looking for, they decided my usefulness had come to an end. But Lucy saved me. Lucy. When things were at their worst, she revealed herself to be an assassin and helped me escape. I was hoping that would be the end of my misadventures. But we were just getting started. Back into another Animus I went. Now, I'm reliving the memories of Ezio Auditore da Firenze, my ancestor from the Renaissance, searching for a path forward. Through the bleeding effect, I'm becoming an assassin in more than just name. It will come in handy as the Templars prepare to enslave us all. They found us. They've crashed our hideout and we're fleeing the scene looking for a place to hide. Only there isn't any, and time is running short. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story.
I like that little rundown that they gave you. Because I noticed there's a lot of people that played Brotherhood that never played any of the other games. and Kind of the same way with Mass Effect 2. There were a ton of people that played Mass Effect 2. Never played the first one. I never understood that. The games have like this huge storyline. And people decide, you know what, I'm not going to play any of the precursor stuff. I'm just going to jump in in the middle. Mario Alvitore, let me hear. I remember all these buttons. Run some diagnostics. I'll get back to you. I love how easy it is to get some of these trophies. Play the first 30 seconds of the game. Trophy. Understand. Please wait. I have so many questions. And as you can tell, I've picked it up. Well, the game's picked it up. I didn't pick it up. The game picks it up at the uh, basically the exact end of AC2. in the hands of man. Uncle! What can I say? We sent a single man against an entire army. I was worried. Quick, climb up. We have to get out of here. And here comes tutorial time. Figure out... Whoops. I don't like that. Let's change that. Uh, third person Y axis invert. There we go. Nothing fancy here, just your regular. If you've played any of the other games, this is like tear jerkingly easy. Would not believe the things I have seen, Mario. Then be sure to stay alive that I might hear of them. I expect opposition. And I expect the Borgia to mourn the loss of many lives tonight. I agree. I'm down for killing. Let me get in front. 
you're more than likely going to be taking some damage. Che cosa fate qui? Assassini! God will see you pay for your crimes! You have desecrated the sanctity of this holy place! You condemn what you do not understand! We must go, Ezio, now! Standard pushing puzzle. Get out of the way. Ow. Thank you. Did Rodrigo manage to hurt you? Barely. My armor blunted his attack. I don't think there's any bad guys out here. Oop. Oop. Be ready to fight. Oops, sorry, I'm in your way, aren't I? What are you doing? Saving you from the lost. Not bad for an old man. Agree. You still have some skills. Buona questa! Excellent! Good one! Impressive! Oop! Where'd you go? Don't run away from me. And as you can tell, my ability to counter people is greatly increased. They added chain attacking. I'll have to go into that in more detail soon. Oops. The only real problem I've had with some of these repetitive tutorials from game to game is that uh, because there's a lot of people that won't have played any of the other games, they have to do this. But the problem is, is they have to do it relatively slowly. So, if you are proficient in these games, you're going to have a tendency of running into him all the time. I'll go into the chain combos a little more detail when I've got some time, but I think I've already said that, so... going. Don't slow down. And yet he slows down. Oh. Pardon me. This decision is yours alone to make. Only do so quickly! Give it to me. You can do with it as you will later. Bene. Jump! Okay, let's see if I can explain this real quick. The uh, the chain combo system is basically if you make a kill and then you push the directional stick in the direction of a new opponent and hit the uh, was it square button for attack, you'll just instantly reach over and hit the next guy and kill him. Uh, the only problem with that is you can usually only chain two together or three until somebody is going to start attacking you again, at which point you have to switch and do a actual counter kill to keep the chain going. 
Then Minerva talked about the sun. She told of a disaster that occurred long ago, and another that is coming. Sometime far in the future, Vero. Then we need not worry about it. See, si. Perhaps our work is finished. Would that be so bad? <laughs> we upgraded the arsenal while you were away. Ah, oh, and it is now customary for you to fire cannonballs at visitors. My apologies. We only installed them a few days ago. My men are still being trained in their use. Understandable, I guess. It's like really angry if you get more than like 15 feet away from Mario. Another new feature in Brotherhood. The ability to ride your horse into town. Sorry. Ezio! Look, it's Ezio! Let me see! Buongiorno! It's good Look to be home! Two of them. This place just keeps getting better. Thanks to you. Brother! Claudia. It is good to be home. How is mother? She's fine. I, I heard you were returning, but I'm glad to see it with my own eyes. The Contessa of Forli is here to welcome you. I had no idea you were so famous. Katarina? Here? Is it finished then? Is the Spaniard truly dead? Gather the others in Mario's study tonight. I'll explain everything there. Steal yourself, Ezio. They will have many questions. Claudia, tell the Contessa I look forward to seeing her this evening. I bet you do. You little horn dog. Okay. Now we've got a couple of mini missions to take care of. Just to get you used to some of the interesting Cazzo. normal things. Need some help. Salve. So many flowers. Your husband must be very lucky. I am the lucky one. I have you here to aid me. Let me see what I can do. Back there, I may have given you the wrong impression. Oh? I have no husband. The flowers are for a party. Am I invited? To Claudia Auditori's birthday party in the villa. If you are willing to help me again, I need someone with class to accompany me. What makes you think I have class? I could tell the moment I saw you. No one in this town walks with such bearing. I'm certain Ezio Auditori himself would be impressed. Oh? What do you know of Ezio? Claudia thinks the world of him, but he rarely visits her. From what I gather, he's distant. She is right. I have been. Oh no. You? The party was intended to be a surprise. Promise you will not tell Claudia. What will you do to keep me quiet? I am sure I can think of several things. I'll be waiting to hear them when we get there. And here we are, thankfully. Now about earning my silence. I have something in mind. There is one condition. Anything. You must wait until tomorrow. If it pleases you, I will not stand in your way. It will be worth the wait, Ezio. Trust me. It had better be. Okay. Luckily, these last two are relatively close to each other. I love how I still have all my equipment. I'll stick with that. I wonder if the yeah D-pad controls are still good. Buongiorno, Ezio. 
Mario is going to murder me. I have lost his favorite horse. Do not despair. I will bring it back. God bless you, Ezio. And for some reason, I can never catch this horse the first try. Okay. Let's see if I can do it. Come here, horsey. Which way are you gonna go? Come on. Come on. Ah! Bastard. Oh, sweet! Totally got him. Normally I have to chase him like two or three revolutions back and forth. Uh, here. Grazie, Ezio. I can no longer keep up with the horses. Promise me you will enjoy your good health. Do not spend as much time in battle as your Uncle Mario. My battles have already been won. That is good news. Arrivederci, Ezio. Somehow with this game, and then Revelations being about your life as well, I highly doubt your story is done. Okay. So... Final one is up here a little bit. By the way, I probably bugged out that horse on that tree. I'm not gonna say I was skilled there. Pretty sure that was luck. So, these are the new cannons? Yes, Signor Ezio. May I try one? Yes, but... Go on, tell him. We cannot seem to make them work properly, and the fool who mounted them is nowhere to be found. Then it is up to me to find him. We do not want to waste your time. It is not any trouble. I have all the time in the world now. Now we're on a mission to find this lazy bum who doesn't want to fix his own cannons. Even though that's the only reason I've... Well, not me, but Mario's brought him here. And here he is, not too far. Get up. Salve, Messere. We need you to fix the cannons on the battlements. Leave me be. I do not begin repairs before noon. Do you know what time it is? I make cannons, not clocks. If you are busy, someone else will fix them. Uno momento. No one else will touch my cannons. Get off your lazy Soldiers ass. Soldiers have no respect for artillery. They expect a gun to work like magic. You need to feel her out. Give her a little encouragement. We are only equipped with simple cannons now. But I got hold of a design from France, yeah? a hand cannon. Something called a wrought iron murderer. Imagine firing a cannon from your hands. <laughs> that, that is the future. I guess I could show you this and impress you. All right, here's the dude. What have you done? We used them. They were not ready for firing. You could have gotten us all killed. Let me see. <laughs> His breath is more fatal than our cannons. Only when you two fools are shooting them. There, try it. Fire the dummies. Aim at something to test the alignment. Ugh, I've never liked this. How do I shoot? R1. Hey, not bad. Oops. I hit the berm. The aim mechanism is fine. The problem must be behind that. Okay, three more targets. Oops. Here. Okay. These aren't that difficult to use. 
They're, I mean, they're a little awkward, granted, but basically just point and click for the most part. Perfect. At least someone here knows how to shoot. Now for the other one. I must go. Thanks for your help. If you hear the cannons tomorrow, do not worry. We will be practicing at dawn. Too bad it will not do you any good. Very funny. Now fix the second cannon. No respect. No respect. All right. Um. Easy way down. Oh, <laughs> 